Giles Thomas from MuscleDevelopment.com. We're joined with eight-time Mr. Olympia, Ronnie Coleman, a very good friend of mine. Yeah, buddy. Ronnie, it's so good to see you, mate. Oh, always good to be here at this wonderful event. <laughs> Probably the uh, best event of my life, you know, bring back the best memories, best times. Uh, I'll never forget it. What, what was your, your favorite year for you in the Olympia? Man, I'm going to have to say 1992. 92, the first one in Helsinki. Yep, yep, my very first, <laughs> my very first time on the Olympia stage. Something I never thought would ever in a million years happen to me. And uh, uh, I remember in 91 when Lee uh, won his uh, eighth one, mm -hmm. people came up to me like, man, you should be up there. I'm like, no, I, I'll, I'll never in my life make that stage. I'm nowhere near good enough to be up there. And the next year, I was up there. Mm -hmm. So... I got to say, that's probably the most memorable one. I mean, it wasn't an instant uh, rise for you because it was 1995, the, the next time, no, 1994. Yeah. And then 1995. 94, 90, 94 was uh, like an okay one. You know, that's my first call out. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't get the call out in 92, but I was there. And it's, but it was something that I thought would never in a million years happen to me. So, you know. I, I, I got to go with 92 as being the best, but 94 was okay because I got my first call out ever. <laughs> and then obviously uh, the big year for you was 1998 in New York. Uh, yeah, another real unbelievable event, something that I thought in a million years would never happen. You know, first, first of all, you got to get there. When, once you get there, you got to get a call out. <laughs> you have to get a call out, you got to get a placing. And uh, winning it is uh, something that's truly unbelievable. Uh, you fell to your knees, didn't you? Remember, I always remember that iconic moment. I don't, I don't even really remember what exactly happened to me. All I remember was them calling Flex Wheeler for second place. Yeah. And uh, after that, uh, Vicky Gates was picking me up <laughs> off the floor. <laughs> Fantastic. And I remember watching the tape and I saw Chris come over and say something to me. I saw Flex say something to me. And to this day, I have no idea what they said. It was all a, just a blur. <laughs> it was just a blur because I, I said after after Flex Wheeler being called second, uh, I don't I don't remember too much of nothing after that. So obviously, you've mentioned Flex Wheeler. Now tonight, we saw Flex Wheeler come back at 52 years old. What was that like seeing him up there? Tonight? That was one of the most amazing things I've ever seen in my life because uh, I didn't get a chance to see uh, Kevin last year, and seeing Flex up on stage is uh, sort of like a miracle. You know, a miracle, like, right before your eyes. It's something that you never thought you'd see in a million years. You know, I, I almost like me being on Olympia stage, you know. But seeing Flex up there after, after all he's been through, oh, man, and how good he looked, it was truly amazing. Did his speech? One of the most amazing things I've ever seen probably in my lifetime. Really? Really? Hey, I tell it like it is. I, I never thought he'd even make it this far, wow. not alone be up there uh, opposing, you know, looking that good, you know. The, the thing that really got me was how, he, the way he looked. He looked truly amazing, and he was like some of the best condition ever. Uh, I, I don't know how he did it. I have no idea how he did it. I don't, I, I don't, like I don't think I can say is uh, God did it for him. <laughs> Because I, I don't think Flex could have did that on his own, for sure. Did, did you like his speech? Uh, Flex has always been one of the most gracious speakers out there uh, uh, in our sport. So, yeah, I, I love this speech. Yeah. Okay, so obviously, so obviously talking about the Open, uh, you've just seen the Bill Heath and Dexter and all those guys. What's your take on tonight's show? Man, I, this, is, this is one of the uh, most undecided Olympians I, I, I've been to in a long time. So uh, I, I, I really have no idea. I, all I can say is William Bonnick looked uh, yeah. <laughs> truly unbelievable. Yeah. <laughs> Phil looked amazing. And uh, Brahmi was huge <laughs> with a capital H. <laughs> Do you think it's going to it's gonna be a bit of a shake-up with the placings this year? Mm. Anything is possible. I, went, I, 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 I got uh, ninth in 1997 and first in 1998. Anything is possible. Wow. <laughs> Ninth the first. Uh, this is. I mean, this is. You know, I mean, this is close placing. You know, 
So yeah, yeah, for sure. I, I, I see a shakeup. <laughs> I'm going to just tell it like I see it. I see a shake-up coming. Are you looking forward to tomorrow night? I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Ronnie, well. Right there in the front row. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, it's always a pleasure. Um, it's really good to see you, and it's good oh. to see your recovery still going well. Oh, yeah, I'm hanging in there. You know me, I ain't got no other choice. <laughs> yeah, buddy. <laughs> and he never stops smiling. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> with my good friend, That's Ronnie how I roll. Cole. <laughs> yeah. With, with Ronnie Colburn, <laughs> yeah. the yeah. king. Yeah, like you said it, the king. Oh, yeah. I'm Giles Thomas from musketvelopment.com. <laughs>